So we are on drummer number four, our last drummer of the series, Jeff Randall, who has toured extensively with Philip Phillips. And he's a great drummer, solid dude. Me and Connor both met him off of Instagram and he's gonna come over. We're gonna get some lunch and then we're gonna shed for a bit. And uh, yeah, this series has been pretty interesting to say the least. Um, never done anything like this. Super huge shout out to Connor for arranging most of this and all the drummers that have been associated with this. So um, Connor's gonna be setting up Jeff's kit, which is one of Connor's kits here. Um, and we're just gonna kinda go through some stuff and get ready for the day. So good morning and get ready for some shredding. So we are setting up Jeff's kit, which is the kit you were playing day one and two, right? Yeah, so this is the, the vintage Gretsch kit that I'm gonna mismatch the toms again. Um, yeah, I hit up Jeff yesterday and um, asked him if he wanted to bring his own kit. And he was like, nah, I wanna try some of those Gretsch drums, <laughs> so. Cause what does he play? Um, I'm actually not, I think he plays Sakai. I'm, I'm not 100% sure okay. what he plays. Um, yeah, I think, I think he plays Sakai though, but which are great drums, but. Um, and then I, th I love that you have a mop in here. Yeah, mop head. I learned that from Matt Goldman at Glow in the Dark Studios. Um, he always had one in his kick drum and first I thought it was cool, but then I realized it's actually a great thing for muffling and uh, it's cheap. So why not? Yeah. Cause you mostly see like pillows or like sheets or something. Yeah, totally. I don't like putting something too big in there. I'm, I'm only trying to muffle a little bit. Mm -hmm. And on top of that, um, yeah, the mop is so it's just easy to move around and you know yeah you can really manipulate it too. yeah yeah absolutely that's awesome sweet so we're gonna go get grub with jeff and then we're gonna come back here and drum sweet see you in a bit all right so now's the point where i get to stick a camera in your face <laughs> go for it man. <laughs> Got your a7 III there. Yeah, dude. Got your Sigma lens. Sigma <laughs> lens only. Cool. Like how Connor backs Gretsch, that's how I'm with Sigma. Yeah, man, that's <laughs> what I'm using. They have this trio of lenses for, you know, my system. Yeah. It's really nice. <laughs> cool. Man, it's so cool to see this. I know, right? A lot of drums in this house, for sure. <laughs> Is that a 70s? The Rogers? Yeah. I think so. I think this is 70s. It's like a matte white, that's then, cool. Yeah, yeah, super cool. I love that finish. And these guys are 80s, concert times. I just got this kit. Um, just got a ridiculous deal on it, so I had to do it. And then the yellow drums are new. I yeah. got those a couple years ago. Um, Was that the custom yeah. kit they made for you? Yep. Nice. Yeah. Yeah. That's, is that like a Tony Williams yep. homage? Yep, yep. yep. The color, the color is called Tony Williams yellow. Is it? <laughs> yeah. Like in their catalog, yeah. It's called Tony that's Williams That's genius. Yellow. Yeah. Yeah, man. That's a bold so, statement. I respect that. I had to do it. For my first Gretsch USA Custom, I had to do it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So if you want to get comfortable on this kit over here, move around whatever you need to move around. For sure. Um, and then we'll, you know, adjust the mics from there. Yeah, I tried to make it, I tried to do a cymbal setup that I figured would suit you. I appreciate that. <laughs> I feel, I know, I know what you, I know what you play, so. And he had a mop head in the kick and he was like, oh, I've just always used that. I had one lying around one time and I liked how it sounded. I think what I like about it is that when I have a blend, pillow I'm not crazy about just cause it's usually too big. And yeah. it, for, for me, it usually just too much muffling. And then a blanket, uh, I, I, it would like bunch up in a certain area sometimes or like I'd have to reach in there and move it around. I just like that the mop head is just floppy and it just kind of by default weighs itself to the bottom. It makes sense. And you know, to be honest, people always ask about it, which is kind of like, I'm like, you know, it's one of those cool things where it's like, you have a mop head in there? And I'm like, yeah. Like the phone? The phone yeah, the phone there. mic. Everyone asks about the phone mic too. Yeah. The phone mic, iconic. I gotta give me a phone mic. They're pretty like, cool. Yeah, I need a distorted mic. I yeah. Need like a ribbon mic, yeah, cheap yeah. ribbon. That's a cool yeah. undertone. Yeah, you know? it is. People were asking about it on the stream too, and I isolated it at one point. Yeah. Cause someone was like, why do you have a 
telephone back there. And I think because it matches my kit, people always think it's just like some kind of decoration or something. Yeah. I'm like, no, it's a mic. So I, I, I isolated it on the stream. Um, Does it come in different colors? Yeah, it comes in. Can I get one in red? Yeah, it's <laughs> black, red, and yellow. Oh, uh, really? Yeah. Oh, it's like a Tesla. Yeah, it's black, <laughs> three colors. Yeah. Cool. Having the other drummer come up with whatever they want to play so that, you know, it's kind of like, because if I did, if I set the, groove that we do every time. It's just gonna be the same video over and over again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I figured you play whatever, you know, whatever tempo and groove is comfortable for you and we'll work around that and kind of just play together and trade fours a little bit and that kind of thing. Yeah, man. Cool. I'm gonna take the Sweet Ride off. Maybe I'll put on K Light Ride or something. Something a little washier, something bigger. Maybe a, maybe a 22. I think I have another Renaissance ride, so maybe I'll put for that. Is this the Renaissance ride? Yeah, that's like the best symbol ever, dude. That was my favorite symbol. It yeah. is. It's yeah. so good, man. It's unbelievable. It's yeah. so good. What's the uh, Ronnie Bucci, the Killers drummer? Dude. Dude. Yeah. You know, dude. got me into these. Oh, yep, yeah. me too. Yeah. They me too. vary a lot, too. Like, no two of these sound alike, I find. They can get really trashy, yep. or they can actually be pretty clean. Yeah. It's kind of funny how they make them. Yeah. They do vary a lot, for sure. But actually, no, I'm gonna go with... Yeah. yeah. See, I prefer, I prefer that one. That's why. Yeah. Yeah. 22 inch uh, Avidus. Yeah. Uh, I, it's Great it's symbol. So good, but I love that. Yeah. The stencil logo. Beautiful. Yeah. yeah. So we'll go with this, yeah, baby. It's bad. Yeah, it's bad. That's right. I don't really like playing in shoes, but depending on what shoes I have on, I'll just I'll go for it. How'd you like it? How'd you like the Gretsch? Oh man, I love it. Love it? Yeah. I want one. You gotta play, you gotta play this one. Oh, yeah, play, yeah, play that one. Yeah. Oh, nice top they, they do feel a little different from the, from the old guys. Set is yeah, that what you'd yeah. say? It like drags a little. Yeah. So you don't have to fight it as much, huh? Right. I really like the five thousand just out of the box. That's cool, man. That's yeah. Just it out of the box. Maybe it's that long pedal, but it's it's easy to control because it doesn't have a mind of its own. Like the XF that you're liking, the long it might be the longer footboard that you're that you're digging. Yeah, man. Because I'm kind of uh, I'm just OCD with uh, accidental hits mm -hmm. that I don't intend on. Right. And so that nine thousand, you have to really watch out for. Right. You know, because it's so, so sensitive. Smooth. Yes. Yeah. And this one, like, I feel like I feel like cleaner once I'm used to it. Yeah, because you got to work a little more to get a solid hit. Thank you so much for coming by. Thanks for having Appreciate me. Appreciate it. Appreciate that. Jeff Randall, the man, the myth, the legend. The legend. No chops. Yeah. Right. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Connor yeah. Dennis. Honor Dennis. Thanks for having me, bud. It was yeah, fun, dude. man. Thanks for coming by. Again. Appreciate sure. it. Try not to get attacked by the dogs on the way out. All right. That's all we can ask. We got Billy being carried. I love you. <laughs> you love me.
Are you kidding me? <laughs> Literally <laughs> grabbing my arm. You just cracked my neck. That's how the league used to be. Come on. That's how the league used to be. Come on, street ball. No blood, no foul. Street ball, yeah. She's trying to get an and one deal. Shoot it. If you hit this, you win. No pressure. Oh my gosh! Look at that! Connor, two L's in a row. I just won horse, okay? I just won horse. That's, that's correct. Let, let the record show. He's not lying. Let the record show. Oh, come on! <laughs> oh! I'm not putting any of this in the vlog. <laughs>